Okay, so now I'm gonna work on a little bit of plans work. It puts a little bit more strain on the wrist. So you gotta make sure you stretch your wrist out, get them nice, loose, and flexible before even attempting to work on this skill. I still got a long ways to go myself, but gotta get that working. Yeah. But how are everybody doing today? Yeah. So we out here at Royal Wall getting ready to hit Grant Park. Uh, gonna get a good little workout in again. I'm supposed to be meeting some guys out here for a little training session. So so I get 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 the guys, you know, get them all physical and stuff. I don't know how to explain it so it to make sense. But yeah, yeah, good, good little workout plan for them. Well really, I didn't put much thought into it, you know. I'm just gonna, you know, go into the archive, the brain, follow cools, and come up with some good stuff for them to do. It's gonna be something simple. You know, these guys are just really in, getting into the mix of their fitness journey, so it'd be nice to add something that they might haven't seen or done before to uh, get them into that next level. And hopefully, they enjoy what, what I'm gonna uh, teach them today. And Hopefully they show up for one, because if they don't show up, then you know, I'll be by myself. It's going to suck, because I don't want to be by myself. Help people grow, learn, prosper, become better in the fitness because that's what it's all about at the end of the day. And did I make a wrong turn? I think I made a turn to I was just so eager to get out of here. But that's all right, because it's going to be like another hour or so before I see them anyway. So, until then... So there's actually some people out here today. Uh, I guess uh, a family with some kids and everything. That's cool, you know, to get to get out, hang out, and um, have that family time, and as well as get a little workout and all that stuff, mess around. That's always cool to have that with the kids and everything. But uh, I'm gonna see if I can get in somewhere, get my little bit of a workout in, and wait for the guys to show to show up. They should be coming an hour after I'm through. I probably still do a little bit of something with them, but I kind of want to just get really in depth and like explaining things. So I really do hope they come out because this is going to be like really good, especially for you guys out there on YouTube. It's going to be really good if they show up. So let's get in and get a little bit of me working out. Not sure what I'm going to work on. Probably some skill training. Probably don't do a little bit with my handstands because I've been kind of lacking on my handstands and my planch. So we're going to work on that a little bit today. So i see you when we get there. Yeah. We're doing a lot of press warm-up for, you know, the handstand, press to handstand. So I want to continue doing a little bit more of that because I've been practicing on that for a few days now. So I'm going to get a little something going. A little something. And stand and planche. Two skills that I'm working on, but I don't do enough. I would say I handstand more than I do practice on my planche. It really difficult skills to attempt to do. Handstand not as bad, but the planche takes a while and I'm definitely not doing it often enough. But still getting better. I would love to train these skills a little more often. It's just so much with training this skill, training that skill, then doing my repetitions and just the progressive overloads and throughout each day. Sometimes when I'm not even doing like a full just training session, I'm probably just doing yoga and that'd be the only thing that I did as far as my physical fitness for that day. A little bit of crow. Crow's pretty cool. I like crow. It was easier learning crow than it was when you learned press. Press needs more flexibility in the hamstring. With crow, you just need a little more Honestly, I don't even think I practice crow as much as I used to back when I was starting my handstand journey again. That's something I probably need to just get back into because it's, it's really fun and to perfect 
my form and just to be looking cool and all that good stuff when I do it, it would be great. Come on now, who doesn't want to look cool when they're doing like stuff that a lot of other people aren't able to do? I know I do, but you can get there too. Speaking of things that look cool that most other people can't do, check me out showing off doing this human flag. Boom! That's bad right there. That's bad. That's like if you can do that, then you can do all to like 25 pull-ups. Minimum. Well, you're giving me credit. You're giving me more credit than, <laughs> than what I'm worth. <laughs> that's hard, man. Going sideways like that, that's so hard. Is it easy? Yeah. <laughs> you see, that's not you make easy, it look man. Like it's easy. That's not easy. <laughs> Lots of training. <laughs> That is smooth he's right there. Buff. I like it. Sorry, he's <laughs> man, you gotta love the kids, man. It's like he's buff. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel great. Just being able to do that. I, I, that's like one of the like main reasons why I like doing like these gravity defining skills is just to be able to show off in front of kids. Like, yeah, man, you can be just as great as what you may think I am because I'm just a regular person and. It took a lot of time to be able to get to where I'm at, and I'm still pushing to go further. And you can do anything that you want. Just prevail, push, move. You got it. Kind of sucked, but just as I was expecting, uh, didn't show. It's after 4 o'clock. Well, I guess we're supposed to meet up at 4 or whatever. I figured that they will probably be here, but I don't know. I'll wait a little bit longer, but... Look like uh, they're not going to show. This is why I was like, you know what? I ain't about to mess around or anything. I'm going to make sure I just get my workout in just in case they don't show. And um, I don't really, because I'm not sure if I was going to really participate into everything that I was going to have them do. But since they're not here, I'm just going to go ahead, finish up. Because, you know, we haven't done the one and most important thing that you got to work on every day. Y'all know what that is, right? Legs. Because why? Every day is a leg day. So let's get it. All right, I lied. Before we even get into the leg day portion of the video, we got a little bit more. We're going to do some, what was that, planche, the tuck planche push-ups. We're going to do some of those. It's crazy because still to this day, I don't think I can get more than like five of them out of me. I got to like really test test myself out, you know, see if I can get more. I got to practice on my, my little pseudo planche push-ups and the push-up planche style of things just so I can get better at it because I'm lacking. I'm slacking. I need to get it cracking. Bars. I wasn't really trying to rhyme there. It just kind of happened. And I'm still doing it. Stop it. Those tuck plans push-ups are so difficult. Not an easy task. I gotta say, I gotta say, I love using these in my workouts. Just that 12 kilograms, 26 pounds. I love using these when I'm out here to get my leg workouts because it just gets that, ex that extra external weight, you know. So we can do body squats all day, but to add one of these puppies on, that's big difference. Welcome to my leg workout. Yeah, this is pretty much like most of what I did over the summer when it came to legs, just because I wasn't back in the gym like how I am now, where I'm just going with a progressive overload, doing just full on weighted squats and other various uh, squat variations with weight on top of it just to get that 
external force to build those beautiful legs the way that I want to build them because there's nothing wrong with doing it all body weight but let's be honest here you know being a bar athlete you're not really doing much with your legs mostly just upper body so I'm going to stick to where I came from and that's the more of the weighted list in that aspect just because you gotta be well rounded man you can't be out here lacking and slacking Now we're gonna wrap this up with some calf raises because who doesn't like doing calf raises it's funny though because the calves like are the one muscle that has little to no extra exercises that you could do to like build them is like all right you got calf raises you can like got calf extensions that you can do from a seated position you can do squats and on the eccentric part of the exercise you could um, extend in, at the cast so it's like it's not much you could do there so they're looked upon as one of the weaker exercises but it's still you you need them for that explosiveness when it comes to uh, jumping running and things of that nature so the thing is with calf races I kind of want you kind of want a platform so you can go below the actual surface of the platform, but at the same time, you need something to stabilize, to hold on to so you can keep your balance. It's kind of hard to try to like balance and do it at the same time. I mean, if you got the balance, then that's cool, great. But you want to be able to fill it and hit that calf as best as possible without having to, you know, compensate for the balance or lack thereof balance that uh, you have. So yeah, that's kind of where I'm going with that. But we're going to continue, do two more rounds of this good stuff. And then I think that's going to be it. So I guess I see you at the intro. I mean, the outro. Or depending on what happens next. Yeah. Form check. Fatigue, fatigue. I ain't even fatiguing my arm. I ain't even really even that fatiguing my core. <laughs> it's all good though. Uh, guess we're gonna wrap it up here though. So, unfortunately, they didn't come out, they didn't show, so I didn't get really be able to go into this amazing routine that I wanted to put them through. But that's all right. At least y'all still got a little bit of what I was doing today. A little bit of skill workout and everything. Nothing too extravagant. And all the other good stuff that I might have shown in this video. Who knows? We'll see when I get to edit it. But if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. That would be greatly appreciated. Help this uh, channel grow. You know, get some more good content out here. Also, leave some comments in the comment section below. I'd like to know your thoughts. What you would like to see happen in the channel. And things that I'm, you might be curious about. That if I have it in my knowledge, I will share. And if I don't. Uh, I will learn. So yeah, I'll be able to share it to you. Subscribe if you're new here. Turn those post notifications on so you can be the first to view my content. As well as always, this is my line PG. Also known as Gamer. And I'm out. Deuce. A lot of work, though. I came a long way, so I just got to stay focused, stay motivated. And keep pushing myself and... You know, just going on to become a better me.